I am not a big fan of New Year's resolutions. So it may surprise you to learn that I am a big fan of planning. The way that I like to plan my new year is to find a quiet place. This year it's vacation. We're at a little bungalow, my husband and I. He's off golfing and I've spent some quiet time alone. What I like to do in this time is reflect on things that went really well, well for me last year and sit down and visualize what the future is for me in my personal life as well as my business life. What do I want that to look like? How will I feel when I achieve that vision? And hold that really tight and just kind of meditate on it or just expand your thinking around what does that ideal state look like. Once you get it really clear in your mind, you can sit down then and create some goals for the coming year. Which goals are going to bring you closer to that visualization that you had? And think about some of the things that you've done the previous year that aren't going to take you in that direction. Choose those things to stop doing. This year, when you think about New Year's resolutions, I would really encourage you to try this exercise. It is so fulfilling. You get really clear on what it is you want to create, and it'll help you create plans that will take you toward that vision. You may not get all the way there in 2019, but you'll definitely make much bigger leaps towards that vision than if you don't sit down and do the exercise then next year, start it all over again. Every year, you'll get closer and closer to that ideal vision that you have for you, your family, and your business. I'm excited to start 2019, and I'd love to hear your thoughts on the reality that you're creating and how this exercise helps to move you closer to your ideal success. Wishing you a fabulous 2019, so much success in your personal and business life, and I'd love to be part of that journey with you. So let me know how it goes.